I guess we're starting. Hello, everyone. We're here to play a little drawing game, and I'm here with Jaden Animations. Hello. Hello. So what we're doing is we each chose a Pokemon. We're changing the type of yeah. the Pokemon. Let's get started. You have to change Beedrill into a fighting type. Beedrill is a pretty dope Pokemon, I think. Mm -hmm. You have Farfetch'd, and you have to change him into a Psychic type. A psychic. Yeah. Ooh. Beedrill was on my team. Did you enjoy him? He has this move called Pine Needle. I think it's Pin Missile. He hit it more than once. He hit the Pokemon yeah, more than once. Yeah, it's Pin Missile. No, I think it's Pin Needle. Or Twine Needle or something. What was your original team? I do not remember. I chose Squirtle because I had Pokemon Blue, and I thought... Since it's blue, then I should get... I was I was a little kid, all right? Squirtle's gonna be the best, because this is a Pokemon blue. And I want to say a Parasect was on my team, too. Really? He's, yeah. like, one of the weakest Pokemon, I honestly. <laughs> when, <laughs> when, when they're level 100, though, then... <laughs> <laughs> Beaks from the front are weird. If this is an actual Pokemon, it'd be terrifying. Mm-hmm, because he's, like, really big. It's kind of weird that he was on my team, because as a kid, I was terrified of bees. Really? I'm scared of bees too, actually. Yeah, I got stung. Maybe this could be a video, but I got stung twice from bees. And so I've always just never been able to forgive them for that. I don't know what you're drawing. I don't know how you're taking the rules. I just drew him with boxing gloves on. <laughs> I heard a story about Farfetch'd. I, I heard it on the internet. Apparently there's a saying in Japan where a duck holding a leak is abnormal out of this world. And so having a duck carrying a leak is far-fetched. Ah. Uh... I can't really put shorts on a bee, though. That'd be weird. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> I'm taking creative liberty with what I'm doing right now. People in your last video, I read some comments and they thought I was cheating. But you know what? I wasn't cheating, and I'm taking that as a compliment. <laughs> <laughs> Hate all you want. I couldn't help myself. Okay, here is Beedrill as a fighting type. And far-fetched as a psychic. Oh, oh my gosh, that's awesome. You like jazz? <laughs> oh, it's such a meme. It has a third eye. Oh, that's cute. All right, next one. The one you have to draw is Stantler. Sticks. Mm -hmm. Yours is Meganium, but you have to change him into a ghost type. Ooh, you have to change him into a poison type. Like zoink scoops. What am I going to do differently than just making it transparent have a sheet over its head I'm trying to use all my creative juices right now so i went to um pax and i met up with one other youtuber he does pokemon videos so oh, really? this is this is a relevant story his name is manned jtv pokevids he met up with me at pax and was like oh hey how's it going and then i followed him on twitter i sent him a dm i sent him a picture of my breloom flesh and i said it's the best pokemon in the world so i also sent him a picture of my dog so i said and my dog and then he sent a picture of a figurine of a septile which Aww. is his which is his favorite pokemon and then he sent a picture of his girlfriend and he goes and that's my dog but then he said oh my girlfriend approved of that joke so like this flower right here i was thinking of like oh make it a ghost sheet but that just ended up looking like the breloom tough there's not too many like defining features of poison types i was thinking you'd give them vampire teeth oh uh, deer anatomy is weird Tell me about it. I have a Word document and I made notes for each one. I only wrote one note for this one and it's just bubble butt. Do you believe in ghosts? Uh, <laughs> this topic. Yeah. I mean, um, I could cut it out. I don't have to be in there. What about you? Uh, no. Is it good? Is it bad? Yeah. Put a happy little dead tree right here, you know? Happy little dead tree. This is my poison stantler. This is my ghost. Uh, what's the, what's it called? Bay leaf. Ooh, spooky. Okay, I like that. I made it like poison barbs. I didn't give him ears! Can I fix it? There, I fixed it. Okay, I fixed it too. This is the real one. The one you have to do is Whale Lord, uh, and its new type is flying. You have to do Cacturn, but he's fairy. Uh, this is the same one that the Team Rocket people had, right? They had the the baby one. Did you know that Whalard can actually fly? It can? In the Pokedex entry, it says like his weight and it's mm -hmm. lighter than air, so he can technically fly. Aren't a lot of the Pokedex entries messed up? The balloon Pokemon. Where he drags children. That murders kids. I wonder if I should give him a little beak. 
I remember when they had a new evolution announced, but they didn't know what type it was. Some people were guessing, oh, it's a new type. It's fairy type. I remember thinking like, no, that's not right. They're not just going to make a new type. We gave drawing tips in your video. Uh, we want to do any drawing tips here. Should we? No. Okay. Well, you're going to have a lot of, of free time. Oh, are you not done? <laughs> am, I, am I not done? So we replaced those circles with hearts. If I was coloring this, I'd color it pink. But like a dark pink? No. Is he still a bit evil? Oh, are you <laughs> taking out all the evil? How evil is he? Are any Pokemon really evil? The balloon Pokemon seems pretty evil. They can understand people though, because they... Because we tell them what to do and they listen to what well, we don't tell them what to because they're not real. In the Pokedex entry for Latios, it says it's one of the few Pokemon that can understand human speech. And everyone's like, um, excuse me. Valentine's Day is coming up. Happy Valentine's Day. Here's a cacturn. <laughs> You're the one I prick. Sounds like an insult. It's kind of giving you the ooh eyes. I like how it turned out. I'll write my name next to it. I mean, actually, I can change the color because this is a computer. Look at that. I like it. Are you sending it? Yeah, I mean, I was just staring at it. So this is, uh, what the crap? I keep forgetting the names. What was the cactus name again? Cacturn. <laughs> this is Cacturn as a fairy. Whale Lord as a flying type. Aw. Aw, he's got bows. <laughs> mm -hmm. Aw, you drew little baby Whale Lords. Yeah, yours is adorable. He's like... Mm. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that was fun. This is fun. I'm having fun. So you, it's your turn to do a fairy, and it is Gabbite. 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 Ooh. You have to do Shaman Land as a fire type. Okay. I think it's pretty obvious what I'm going to do. Set him on fire. <laughs> <laughs> What's a fire version of a flower? I don't even know what this part is, but it's in it. It's in my drawing now. Uh, never mind, I just erased it. Uh, yeah, this looks pretty dumb. I'm not proud of what I just did, but I, I think I'm done. It's whatever. Really? I... Oh no, I'm almost done. I'm getting there. Very types, am I right? I kind of made it go Super Saiyan. Airplane. You, are you like by an airport? And they're like, hey, Jaden's house is over here. How about we fly an airplane around it? This is drawn one of the best Pokemons in the world. So here he is as a fire type and the Breloom is watching. Here's my Gabite, who's a fairy now. Oh, <laughs> oh you added a Mario thing. Yeah, a fire flower. Oh, he's thing. pretty cute. Aw. Thanks. Aw. The one I chose is Swoobat, and you're gonna have to turn him into an electric Swoobat. So you have a Molga, and you have to change him into a dragon. Ah! <laughs> a lot of the, the quote unquote dragon type Pokemon aren't dragons. That one fluffy cloud bird is a dragon too. Yeah, that was ears even work. They're like together, but not together. What if we were bad at drawing? Do you think people would still watch us if we were bad at drawing? I mean, obviously, yeah. I have no idea for this one. Same. Oh, he's so ugly. Let me just fix you up, pal. His eyes, that's the problem. His eyes and- no, it's his whole face. Should we, uh, talk about the YouTube glitch? Or do you think that's gonna be old news by the time this comes out? And I feel like there's enough people already making a ruckus, and YouTube's probably freaking out. I've created a masterpiece. Ooh. Ooh. What tool do you use to sketch? The pen. I use the marker. Yeah. Oh, this is so smarter. Amazing. Yeah, because this is dragon. I'm really close. Okay, yeah, take your time, I guess. Actually, no, hurry up. I'm going so fast right now. You, like, if you were on my screen, you'd be like, whoa, Jin, slow down. Dang, I should color all of my things now. More airplanes. <laughs> This is one of the proudest things I've ever made. Oh, mm -hmm. I like this one a lot. I like the little magnet electric thing. I was kind of expecting you to do the fluff more jaggedy, like a Jolteon, yeah. you know? If I was making some edits to your drawing. Not saying your drawing's um, not good. excuse me. I would have, I was imagining like a pow. Your next one, Go Goat. And his new type is Dragon, the one you just made me do. You have Talonflame, and you have to change him into a Psychic type. Can I steal your third eye idea? Do you want to? <laughs> Give him a bunch of eyes. Are there any Psychic Bird Pokemons? 
Nope. No, no, there are. It's that too. That counts. Drawing tips. If you just start, you're gonna be bad. Speaking of psychic, would you ever want to get your uh, fortune told or anything? I don't know if I believe in those. I mean, no, but I think it just it's for funsies. If it was relatively cheap. Whenever I find a new genre on YouTube, I always feel like an explorer. So there's this whole culture on YouTube of, of people doing seances and, and spell casting and people summoning spirits on YouTube. This has turned out weird. I'm gonna keep his hooves. It's not every day that you see a dragon with hooves. It's not every day you see a dragon with hooves, because you know, <laughs> dragons without hooves, I see those on a daily basis. I just had to draw an eye on its forehead. You just couldn't take it seriously, could you, James? All right, yeah, yeah. Wait, that's not good. Beautiful. Terrific. Oh, uh, this is sketchy. <laughs> I want to bring this up before the video ends. I had this comic idea that's a little inappropriate, and I asked people on Twitter, like, oh, is this, a, is this an appropriate comic idea? Everyone was saying, like, yeah, it's fine, do it, do it. But I'm just thinking about all of these kids I met at PAX. Mm -hmm. I'm imagining them all in a room, and they're with their parents, and then I show them the idea, and they don't laugh, and then I say, <laughs> get it? That's like the one thing giving me doubts. All the kids that I met at PAX, they, they ruin everything. I could color with the marker. That's such a good idea. I've never really colored with the marker marker before, but this is, uh, this is good. See, you discover more every day, kids. Yeah, I can be done. No, I just want to finish coloring this. I'm going to call it good. Wait, hold on. Let me just finish coloring it. This is the bird as a psychic type. And this is the goat as a dragon. Ooh, that's cool. Ah, this is cute. What is he holding? Starbucks cups? Remember when I said I'm not taking it seriously? Those are supposed to be uh, ice cream cartons. I like your dragon go-go. I like the little claws and the maleficent horns and there they all are. I haven't seen anyone do this Yeah, before. changing the types. The, yeah. It probably exists. They're gonna show us and be like, look, you copied. Thanks for watching. Everyone go check out Jaden's video now. Thanks. All right, yeah. all right <laughs> bye. Bye.